What's up, YouTube? Back again with another video for you. So, today we're going to talk about... We are going to talk about one of the biggest, baddest, most devilish, evilish Disney villains of all time. No, not, not, not Maleficent's Dragon. However... This dude is pretty intense. None other than Chernabog. The master of Bald Mountain. But, I'm not going to talk about him being evil. Because that's not what I do. See, if you're new to this channel welcome but I like to take a look at the villains and look at the good side of the villains and be like hey this dude is misunderstood I have a whole playlist that I'll link up here of all villains that I think are just misunderstood or possibly the two hero of the story. Now with Chernobog's case, yeah, he's on top of this mountain and we see this village down below and he has he rises demons up and torments the villagers. But we don't see any villagers in panic. So is he really tormenting them? <laughs> Hit the like button and that sky button and let's find out. <laughs> watch Night on Bald Mountain we see Chernabog waking up from his slumber his evil uh, evil devilish look starts summoning ghosts and demons and these fiery ladies that start dancing around and that they're, they're doing just that they're, 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 they're moving around and dancing we don't see any torment actually going on of other people. So it was Chernabog evil because he's not really torturing anybody. He's just summoning ghosts and demons. And then at the end, they all go back to the slumber. And Chernabog goes back under his wings and he goes and takes a nap. So Chernabog is essentially just stolen one hell of a party.
think about it. He just up on top of the mountain. He doesn't go anywhere. He doesn't leave the mountain. He doesn't do anything. He essentially is up there moving his hands and like, you know, getting the crowd going. Trin Bog is a DJ. A hardcore heavy metal DJ. And he's just throwing one heck of a dance party. So yeah. Trin Bog's not evil. They paint it to look like he's evil. And we see him as a quote unquote villain. But he hasn't really done any villainous things that we know of. Another section that we see Chernobog in, besides Night on Bald Mountain and Fantasia, is a cartoon show that used to air, which I would love if they brought this back on Disney Plus, was called House of Mouse. It's basically just all the cartoon characters, you know, all the, the heroes, the villains, everybody just kind of got together and watched cartoons. It, it was really cool. So we see Chernobog in one of these episodes. And Chernobog is more or less a comical purpose in this show. He's He had a few appearances. And the majority of his appearances, the jokes are about him being so large. And when you see him, he's, you know, there's a large dude sitting at a bigger sized table. So he's kind of like hunched over. And it's kind of funny. And then at one point, in one of the episodes, you know, the lights go out, and he goes, I kind of like the dark. And then, in uh, Mickey and Minnie's Big Vacation, uh, Daisy uh, mentions that he and Zeus play darts with lightning bolts. He also loves... Uh, corny jokes, especially where Mickey jokes about Chernobog hosting a Halloween party and says it's easy to get there. All you have to do is take a right at Bald Mountain. And Chernobog laughs and says, it's funny because it's true. So like I said, we don't ever really see him doing anything evil. The only evil thing we ever see him doing in any of his appearances is in the Halloween special of House of Mouse where the villains take over and call it the uh, House of Villains which is a great episode I wish I could find it Chernobog acts as the bouncer throwing out Goofy, Mickey, and Donald um, as Jafar takes over the phone but that's just it's not really evil I guess you could say you know it's more or less he's just following words because he's a villain so he's just going with the crowd and he didn't really you know do anything just kind of prevent them and I mean honestly he doesn't do anything at all you know Mickey Donald Goofy look up to him like oh boy I'm not messing with that so he could have been like you know hey I got a secret for you you know go out of the back and I'll help you out no, just his intimidating look scared the crap out of him. So, what I'm trying to say is, you know, we see other villains doing mischievous stuff. We see them in their movies, in their TV shows, you know, in all their cameos that they have in the Disney universe. They do evilish, devilish schemes. You don't see much of that from Trinabog. All we see is him trying to have a good time, making jokes, and throwing Halloween parties. For all we know, Night on Bald Mountain was that Halloween party that they mentioned. So yes, Chernobog is one of those other villains that is just misunderstood. He's misunderstood because of his looks. So... I ask you not to judge a book by its cover. And comment down below your thoughts. And maybe you can tell me another villain 
that you want me to look into to try to find a good side of them. With that being said, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time.